Hello everyone, this is Brad McMahon with Trader Trading Headquarters. You are watching our free educational video series for traders and investors. All we ask in return is that if you like the video, like it. And if you really like it, share it with a friend. Please take a moment to read our disclaimer. The information provided herein is our opinions only. Under no circumstances do any statements here represent a recommendation to buy or sell securities or make any kind of investment. You're responsible for your own due diligence. To summarize, we do not provide investment advice, nor do we make any claims or promises that any information here will lead to a profit, loss, or any other result. These videos are for educational purposes only. As you might guess from the name, the Hanging Man candlestick formation is viewed as a bearish sign. This pattern occurs mainly at the top of uptrends and can act as a warning to traders of a potential reversal downward. It's important to emphasize that the hanging man pattern is a warning of potential price change, not actually a signal in and of itself to go short. Now the hanging man formation, just like the hammer, is created when the open, the high, and the close are roughly the same price. Also, there's a long lower shadow, which should be at least twice the length of the real body. Now when the high and the open are the same, a bearish hanging man candlestick is formed and it's considered a stronger bearish sign than when the high and the close are the same, forming a bullish hanging man. Now the bullish hanging man is still bearish, but less so because of the days closed with the gains. Let's take a look at a chart. After a long uptrend, the formation of the hanging man is bearish because the price hesitated by dropping significantly during the day. Now granted, the buyers came back into the stock and pushed the price back near the open, but the fact that the prices were able to fall significantly shows that the bears are testing the resolve of the bulls. What happens on the next day after the hanging man pattern is what gives traders an idea of whether or not the prices will go higher or lower. So to recap here, we have a strong uptrend and we form this hanging man formation but we wait for the next day to see what happens. And in this case, we have a sell-off. So this is our confirmation that we are looking at a reversal. If you like this video and would like to learn more about stock charts and patterns, visit our website at tradertraininghq.com. Here you will find lots of information on trading the markets. Go to our training tab and you'll find free courses articles, trading view charts, watch lists, trade examples, books, and even a chat room. If you'd like to get a fill for our membership benefits, fill out this information here and create a password and you'll get access to more free lessons. The free lessons include simpler stock trading for beginners, candlestick patterns, chart patterns, free introduction videos, webinars, and a trading community where you can access all of our social media links.